Hello, welcome. Welcome to the tutorial on how to do my command. I uh, I can't pronounce the word. That's why every time I try to pronounce it, this is gonna happen. So the way I set it up is I build two buildings identical. But I so this one is a four by four, just little room that it looks like you're gonna turn. It really looks like you're supposed to turn when you enter this house. So when you do, that's why it makes the illusion. And you, and I call this furnace the focus point because that's the first block you see and that's the first block you see when you teleport. So just kind of it doesn't kind of look like you've moved at all. So the first step in it is to set up something like this. Just something small, something that looks like you're going to do an action like either going upstairs you're gonna turn or you're going down because the way I do this you can do multiple ways because it doesn't really you can set so much stuff up with it there's a limit I know there's a limit but you could set a lot of stuff up with this command but you need to build a small room that makes it look like you're gonna go upstairs and through a doorway or you're going down a hole or you're gonna turn like I have here and make some make sure if you're going down a hole make sure one block you see so something like so like you're going down the hole put put iron at the bottom I don't know make sure when they fall there's one block there that they can focus on or they see and when they land it's still there and it's like oh I haven't moved same goes with the furnace you walk through it oh it's still there oh it's gotten bigger and I don't suggest you making the two rooms or whatever too far apart because you can get this stupid wait you can get this dumb effect where stuff has to load if it happens eventually I can show you but and to make sure this thing looks real nice you have to do this command so you don't so this is what happens if you don't have the command if you make this true all right I teleport and it gives me a message that I've been teleported you don't want that it ruins the whole thing So you have to make that false. I forgot to mention that in my other tutorial video. But this is going to be a more in-depth one. Hopefully. Uh, what else? Oh, and then, you know, the command. I didn't really do a good job explaining the command last time. This is the command that you want. You can use any block you want. I use smooth stone because it's the easiest one to remember how to... How to type in a command block. You must have that underscore or it won't work. And it has to be typed in exactly like this or nothing will work. Like, say you don't put a space in that, you're done. It won't work. You must have a space. And the coordinates can be anything. But you must have ex execute a your gamer tag or if you're in a single player world you can do the at sign in a like this here I type it in again that's any that's if you're in a single player world but if people are with you then you're gonna do your own gamer tag to single you out so the command knows what it's looking for and then you need to do this sign Things called a delta, and then you need to do detect, and then you need to do that again. I forgot the negative one, and it also must be a negative. It has to be negative. If it's not negative, then it's testing for a block above you, and you don't want that. You could do stuff like that. That would be really cool. Yeah, but you don't want that. And there, okay, so when I mentioned the space, the, uh, 
coordinates don't matter. You you don't have to put a space like um, between the squiggly line and the negative one. There can be no space, or there can be a space. I don't normally put spaces, but just for the sake of showing you, you can put spaces. And then you put smooth stone or any block. You can do slash fill and any coordinates you want or slash give and it brings up any item you can get. It's so like slash give itself. So if you wanted to use a oak plank for the block that teleports you, you just, you know, stripped oak log. You must type in stripped underscore oak underscore log if you're going to use a stripped oak log you just have to find out how to type the block into the command block or or if you just type in smooth stone with no underscore or stripped oak log with no underscores it won't work and then the zero the zero is very important it won't work without the zero i have no idea and then put in whatever coordinates you're using i just typed in those I don't wanna and then and to make it always work you need to have always active or put redstone and put a lever on it or put a redstone block next to it and have it repeat and you must also have command block output false because if not, then sometimes you can get all these messages in your chat going successful, teleported. You don't want that. So you need to put game rule, command block, output, false. And, um, and, you know, of course, final product. And you also, and how I got negative 0.99 so the original coordinates was 141 and then it was just a negative one. You always need to start out with those so you know what you're working with. So this is what it looked like with just basic numbers. Just teleport doesn't look convincing at all. So I kind of messed around with numbers. I did negative one. I did negative 1, 139.5. And, but it sets you back, so that didn't work. Because right when you walk in it, you get kicked out the doorway. You don't want that. So then I tried negative 0.99. And then it didn't work. You get kicked out the doorway again. So clearly 139.5 ain't the answer. So you could try 139.9. It's just a matter of messing with numbers until you get... Um, until you get a good transition. It, so that's not a good transition. But, but this isn't even the best way to do it. There's a better video on how to do this in Bedrock Minecraft. I can put the link in the description, which I will, because anyone looking at on how to do this doesn't need to use my command. They need to use a command that will work better than mine. But, but I think I went over everything. But, of course, this isn't the best transition yeah this probably isn't the best but i think i've went over anything everything i really hope this helps people understand how to use this command this side of command this certain command i've made but 
if you're really looking how to do this, I suggest don't using mine. Mine's just kind of basic. I just wanted to make something like this, and this is the fastest way I thought about making it, and it worked. But there's better ways of doing it, like I said. So I suggest checking out the link in the description. You could try this if you want, and if you like it. But if you really want a good effect, then watch the video in the description. I walked into a different house. Anyways, thanks for watching. Goodbye.